hi guys welcome back to another beautiful video you guys will be talking about eight facts you need to know about ghana as a nigerian or maybe as a ghanaian you know when some nigerians say things like is it not just come on ghana ghana is just behind us you know uh, ghana of yesterday these da -da -da that even some Ghanaians don't even know stuff about them, okay? You know, I went into research and I did my finding and I'm out here, like right now, I'm here to tell you guys, it's shocking things you need to know about Ghana. Maybe just after this video, your mindset, the way you see Ghana or the, rather the way you think about Ghana might most likely change especially especially as a nigerian okay if this type of video you like to watch keep watching and do not forget to subscribe for more entertainment more news more beautiful videos on this space so let's just jump right into this video the fact one is ghana was the first sub-saharan african country to gain independence from colonial rule in 1957 the country was previously known as gold coast okay so yeah they got their independence right before nigeria fact two the name ghana means warrior king in the mande and sonin Kekin language it comes from the ancient west african kingdom of ghana which was located in what is now southeastern Mauritania and western mali the country was given this name on the eve of its independence in 1957. Fact 3. In 1960, Kweme Nkrumah became Ghana's first president. He played a pivotal role in the country's struggle for the independence from British colonial rule. Nkrumah was a charismatic leader who used his oratory skills to oratory skills to inspire the people of Ghana and the rest of Africa to fight for independence and self determination fact four during his presidency nkrumah implemented several progressive policies including free education health care and housing the Inkwema nkrumah university of science and technology in kuma was the first university of its kind in west africa hmm, including nigeria you guys the fact five the ashanti kingdom was one of the most powerful and wealthy states in africa's pre-colonial era it was located in what is now modern day ghana the kingdom is known for the gold and was a major center of trade and commerce are you guys getting it fact six ghana is known for its rich cultural heritage including music dance and festivals one of the most famous festivals is the annual homowo festival celebrated by the ga people which involved the sprinkling of boy boy a local dish made from maize to signify abundance and prosperity fact seven Ghana is the world's second largest producer of cocoa beans after Ivory Coast. The country's cocoa industry employs over 800,000 farmers. It generates millions of dollars in revenue and accounts for 20% of global cocoa production. Ghana is also a major exporter of gold, timber and oil. You guys, world's second largest producer. Get it right. Ghana is home to Lake Volta, the largest man-made lake in the world by surface area covering 8,502 surface square kilometers. The lake was created in the 1960s by damming the Volta River and is used for fishing, transportation, and hydroelectric power generation. The Akosombo Dam, located on the Volta River, is one of the largest hydroelectric power stations in the world, you guys. Like, I know even some Ghanaians do not even know what they have, you know. So before you come out to say, come on Ghana, this, 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 I think you should try to find out facts about Ghana. Let me know other facts that shocked you or other ones, you know. For me, the one that shocked me was knowing the fact that they are the largest second world producer of cocoa. Even this, um, the last, I mean, the fact eight. Let me know other facts, you know. I know I do, I murdered some words there. <laughs> Please don't, don't take it personal, okay? Yeah, I'm always, there is always room for correction. Let me know just in the comment section. And if you're yet to subscribe, please click on the subscribe button for more news, more entertainment on this space. Stay happy, stay blessed, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye, guys. I'm waiting for you guys in the comment section, okay?